So laughter is a very important part of our spiritual path. We should be having fun, says Gurdjieff, as we live this life and do, do our spiritual soulful developments. And Anifus Levi wrote, Laughter is forbearance. Laughter is philosophy. The heavens clear when they laugh and the great secret of deny omnipotence <laughs> <laughs> and the great secret of divine omnipotence resides in an eternal smile. Animals make me smile. They're so gorgeous. So, <clears throat> laughter is forbearance. Laughter is philosophy, says Oedipus Levi. The heavens clear when they laugh. And the great secret of divine omnipotence resides in an eternal smile. And as we know... Laughter lifts the vibrations, hires the vibrations, makes us feel better in ourselves. It creates certain energies that are of a higher vibration, so it's all very important. And I've had people getting in touch with me saying about the Steiner video I put up about um, alchemy and you know how do we work with the dark forces and the demonic entities and Lucifer and Araman. And they probably don't like being laughed at. They take life far too seriously. You know, life is serious at times, but we must always remember to come back to our hearts and smile with our hearts and smile and laugh at things with life. Not at people, we're laughing with people, which is why it's always good to have warm-hearted, loving, smiley people around you. And then I found this Buddhist tract, which talks about how Buddha said that to get rid of the demons, we laugh at them. We laugh at the demons, they don't like being ridiculed. So I suppose we're not ridiculing them, we're kind of just sort of laughing at their demonic ways and how they're trying to bring us down into darker, deeper, why is it deeper? It's, I think it's lower, but darker ways of thinking and feeling, it's lowering the vibrations. So we must remember to smile and laugh. Even though, you know, sometimes <laughs> life throws curveballs at us, but we must try and smile our way through it. Smile at the people that annoy us. Smile at the incidents that come up against us. And I also find that when I'm smiling or laughing or enjoying life, and if I can put that into the things that I find difficult, it makes the things that I find difficult easier to bear. You know, go with a smile, go forth with love and laughter. You know, it's another way of being in touch with the divine source. The divine source wants us all to be happy, on a happy vibe. Now, I know some people are going to say to me, well, that's going to one extreme. It's not balanced, but I'm pretty sure that just going through your life with a smile and, you know, contentment. We're trying to find inner peace and inner peace doesn't come with depression, sadness, anger and things like that. Inner peace comes with a sense of serenity, possibly even serendipity, I nearly said then. I don't know why it's, I'm being asked to say that. Not that I'm channeling or anything, but sometimes words come into my mind as I'm making these shows, because I do them off the cuff, as many of you know. So we want to laugh and smile and try and be with people that make us feel that way. And obviously we are going to be with people that don't make us feel that way but if we can try and help them to lift their vibrations and laugh and smile then we're doing a good job we're doing okay so go forth with a big smile and love to you all and happiness and enjoy enjoy your life